Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Lakme has recently launched um, a range of lip crayons. These are the Enrich lip crayons and they come in this cute little adorable crayon packaging. It's like a crayon with a cap and it is a set of 10 shades that they have launched but I have 5 of these and I'm going to swatch and review these for you right now. Before I swatch these for you, let me just show you the packaging. They come in this adorable little thick um, mini crayon packaging with a cap. It is priced at 185 rupees for 2.2 grams, which I think is really, really affordable. I really like that these are really small because most of the times we end up not finishing up all our lip products. You know, so I personally prefer smaller sizes because I just feel that the number of shades that we all have it's just easier to use up a lip product if it's a smaller size rather than you know the really big tubes that you get so that's just my personal opinion now these are um, I wouldn't say that they're completely matte they give a soft matte finish but they do feel a bit dry when you're applying it so it, it kind of tends to tug your lips a little bit when you're applying it but um, otherwise it's pretty comfortable to wear once it's on your lips um, it is not completely opaque the pigmentation is not that great uh, as you can see a little bit of your natural lip color shows through so the pigmentation is not really really that high but it's pretty good um, for daily wear the lasting power is decent um, my, on my lips, most of the shades have lasted for about 5 hours, depending on what I've eaten. They do transfer, but if it's just a coffee or a light snack, they last for about 5 hours. If it's a heavy, greasy lunch like pizza or, you know, anything heavy and greasy, then it's most of it is going to come off. It has a very um, synthetic, sweety kind of fragrance, which I find very annoying and um, the fragrance does linger a bit so even if you're wearing it you know and your nose is right above your lips so you can smell it and i find that a bit annoying but it's okay i mean for 185 rupees i think this is quite a good product so oops so let's move on to the swatches the skin around my mouth is peeling and flaking a bit because of the sudden change in temperatures i went from very hot to very very cold and back to very hot again so despite using some really good skincare products, it is uh, flaking and peeling a bit, so please just ignore that. So this is shade number one, Berry Red. It is a very pretty color. Uh, it would look good on pretty much all skin tones. It's a lovely red. Um, Texture-wise, these crayons feel just like the crayons that you use for coloring. These, this shade looks very nice. It would look good on pretty much all skin tones. Shade number two is called Red Stop. And this is more of a vermilion red. It's got uh, orange undertones to it. So it is a warm red. It might not look good on all skin tones. I think it would suit more medium skin tones rather than, or even very fair ones. But this is, I don't know why it's looking more orange than it actually is. Maybe, but that's because of the lighting. But it is a nice red for the summer season. You know, when you don't want a very deep, dark red. This is quite a nice one for the summer season. Shade number three is called Candid Coral and this is a very orangey coral kind of color. I really am not fond of such orange shades and I don't think they look that great on me either but this would really suit a lot of uh, fair to medium skin tones. This is also a very good shade for summer if you're the kind who likes these kind of orangey shades. This one is shade number 7. It is a beautiful berry pink that would look good on pretty much all skin tones. I really don't know why they're looking so orangey and yellow toned but I think it's maybe because of the lighting right now. I couldn't do this in uh, during the daytime because I was just too busy but anyway. So this is um, shocking pink and it's a very pretty colour. Shade number 9 is Cinnamon Brown. I mean the name suggests that it's a much darker colour. As you can see it is a very neutral brown, very mid-toned brown that is great for everyday wear, for work wear 
and it's, it's a beautiful color very flattering on the Indian skin tone I think it would look great for work for any kind of meetings just you know as a normal MLBB kind of color and it, I think it would suit pretty much all skin tones so really like it so I hope you like this video please do give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel for more such videos and let me know in the comments which is your favorite shade of the lot also thank you for ignoring my dry peeling skin I think it'll take a few days for my skin to come back to normal I'll see you soon in my next video bye